Really? Okay. Were you... Um, was it because, um... Did you advertise on a channel? Because I'm like, I don't remember. English. Okay. Oh, 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 shit. Okay, this is a lot of things. So we have vibration settings, just queuing time for button inputs and launching attack combos. <laughs> well, I, I, I'm, welcome in. <laughs> Do stereo. Um, prioritize graphics. Oh. Ooh, okay. Select a character you wish to control in the demo. When you clear the demo, you can use see a preview video for the character you were controlling when clearing it. The care and controlling character can be switched during gameplay. However, the bonus movie that plays after clearing the demo will remain based on which whichever character you first selected on the screen. Okay. So let's check out these fucking characters. He's like the main dude. Oh wow, the combat. Ooh, a long range. So he's a swift sword fighter with a ray of arts to combat any type of foe in close quarters combat. Shion, a long range gunslinger who uses astral arts, letting her heal the party. Ooh, I'm a, I'm a, uh, I'm a, a healer, but. Rimwell, a mage who mainly relies on astral arts, though casting takes time for magic. Okay. La, we got the we got the paunchy boy. Okay. okay. Fucking cool. Kasara. We have the hammer lesbian. Oh wow. Her, her she's actually fucking cool. And then just what is this dude? Ooh. Hey, okay, we'll go with Alfin. Okay, let's see what happens. Super excited. Oh, it's beautiful. Wow, it's so fucking pretty. Land of Green, Eld, Anansia. Okay, Let's see what happens. Well, off we go. Oh, just fucking getting right into it. Okay, that's so pretty. Wow. So we have a dash, we have the move, we have jump. Okay. Let's see what happens. Mm -hmm. Oh, it's there's no voice acting. Those Sugals have invested even tranquil places like this, huh? That's a damn shame. <sighs> what do you expect? Tame destroy whenever the run-ins are lurking, Zoogles are sure to follow. Be a surprise if there somehow weren't any Zoogles in these parts. That's great. I know that. It just threw me for a loop a little. Listen, Zoogles are to play depending on the environments they're best suited for. When we visit an area for the first time, we'll have no idea what they're capable of, so think carefully how to put that blazing sword to use. Right. right, I'll keep that in mind. Get moving. Okay. Uh, yeah, give me the tutorial, please. So, we got boost strikes. Normal attacks build up the cage, then when the cage is full, press the... Oh, that's fucking cool. Hits, cure points, allies, arts, art, okay, okay. Um, oh. oh, okay, that's fucking cool. Normal attacks are R1. String normal attacks by learning certain skills. Okay. Arts are by the buttons. All right. Evading is L and R2 to evade. Okay, cool. Let's, let's fucking go. Oh. Swallow blade. Whoa! That's fucking cool! Oh, that's fucking cool! Oh, 
Oh shit! Oh, we have more people! <gasps> Whoa! That was the coolest fucking battle system I've ever played for a Tales game. Holy shit! Whoa! I think I've got the hang of this. Don't let it go to your head. Complacency leads to trouble. You never loosen up, do you? There's no such thing as being too alert in battle. On we go. Alfin's perk. Oh, Alfin's perk. Alfin can sacrifice HP to use a flaming edge, a strong, wide-reaching blazing sword attack. Do so. Hold the... Okay. Which will trigger a flaming edge after your performance of corresponding art. Flaming edge moves cost no AD to use. Flaming edge moves have added the bonus of dealing extra damage to downed enemies. Plus, after learning a certain skill, you can continue holding the button longer, letting exchange more of Alfin's HP. I mean, oh, pretty. At camps and inns, you can cook meals, conferring temporary effects when eaten. New additions can be made by finding recipes, while ingredients can be found at collection points in general stores. Eating a new meal overrides a previ any previous effects. Depending on who in the party cooks a meal, the extent of their effects will du and duration will vary. Will vary. As such, it's wise to rotate who's on cooking duty based on your current goals and uh, the party's overall status. Barely. Okay, so we got some fucking tomatoes. That's fucking cool. We... Oh, we got an apple gel. Yeah, I know what an apple gel is. Wow, it's so fucking beautiful. Let's, okay. I, yeah, I'm ready to go. Let's fucking go. Oh, shit! Oh! Boost strikes are one-hit kill attacks performed in tandem with other allies. When you see the word strike on an enemy, press the... Okay. Hey, right, let's fucking go. Go! I'm sorry, that was so cool. Uh, this is such the fucking coolest. Oh! Uh, th this is so fucking cool. Oh, I'm so happy that it's instantaneous as well. Here's our power squeak. Okay. 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 So, metal engraver. The metal engraver can craft accessories you have from ore. Okay, cool. It's so beautiful. I, I'm, th this game comes out so soon. I'm so fucking, like, excited. Oh. Give me one second. Very quickly do something. Check. Oh, the menu's fucking cool as shit. The menu is very nice. Okay, it's very simple. Uh huh. So, you can assign it through three arts. Press L2 or R2 to inspect the arts you have available. Oh, it changes if you're aerial as well. Wow. That's cool. What is the difference between AG and Follow Blade Rising? So that's showing you you go up if you do that, and then Flaming Edge. I don't know. I want to. What does that do? 
Let's try it out. Fuck it. Okay. We have equipment. Ow. It's so pretty. The character models are ridiculous. Hmm. I know about strategies. Do outfits, which is fucking cool. Cool. Let's go. Hello, sir. Hmm? Hey, you two there. I don't think I've seen you around here before. Are you two from out of town? What? What if we are? What business is it of yours? None, none at all. You just don't look like you know where you're going, that's all. You're right, this is our first time in the area. Then you'll want to head to Vicent, the big capital of El Manasea. Hmm. Just know that, as you can clearly see, the area is crawling with zoogles, and they all seem to be even angrier than usual. If you're not looking to get jumped by them, stick to the highway. It's safer than trying to cut across the rough and run into trouble. Although, judging by that sword you're carrying, maybe you thrive off danger. If that's your thing, I won't stop you, but don't say I didn't warn you. Anyway. Vincent, hmm? What do you think we should do? <sighs> Not like we have anywhere else to go. Better than wandering these fields aimlessly. Got it. Then it's settled. We're off to Vincent. Safe travels, folks. I'm going to hang around here a bit longer in case more travelers like you two lose their way. Okay. I'm going to go turn on my fucking air conditioner <laughs> really quickly. I'll be right back. Uh... All right. On, guys. It is hot as fuck up here. Let's go. God, it's so cool. Donk. Go. This is so cool. Donk. It's it's so chaotic. That's what I like. 
It, it's so good. Ooh. Okay. Ooh, that's some mushrooms. Thank you. Mushrooms. Let's go. Ooh. Ooh. Oh, I died. <laughs> Oops. Thank you. Jesus, it's so fun. A hard won victory. Funk. This should be a good place to fight. Wow, Kisara, it's so big. This, the the battling is great. Oops. Yes. Want to rest here? We got some peppers. Hello. For those times of victory is almost in reach. It's our job as shopkeepers to help you get the rest of the way there. Okay. We have. No, I don't need that. Mm hmm. We need some pork. Some lemons. I'm just gonna fucking carry some lemons around with me. Here's some lettuce. No, we need the fucking lettuce. Cool. We need some wheat. Um. Where's the one that heals everyone? Well, this person doesn't have shit. Oh. Oh, that's such a good perk. Uh huh. Okay. Oh, okay. 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 Let's check it out. You, you can never. So, are they all in battle with me? Resting in a campground will restore to your party's HP and CP. While resting, you can watch skits and cutscenes that you've previously viewed. Aired. But did we have to spend so much? <laughs> oh, I love the thrifty ass like person that's like we spent too much money. With battle well waged, only waging of words and a feast remain. You. Do I cook here? Apparently not. You want dinner? Is that what you're saying? This is cute. Yes, let's cook. Okay, so we can make a chicken. A whole chicken that's been thoroughly roasted inside and out. Succulent juices drip from the... It looks fucking good. Uh Oh, that potato looks really good. A dish of true to its name, steamed potatoes. More still has yet... Has to be done with it before it can be truly considered a proper meal, however. Okay. 
ice cream. Yeah, I'm just gonna fucking make an ice cream. I mean, she is a mage, so that kind of tracks. I really like that, like, uh, that, uh, attention to detail. Like, she has magic. She can freeze things. A sweet made by freezing milk and eggs, though perfect in hot weather. There's something to be said for having it on cold days, too. Um, Minue. Dish made by coating a fish in flour before cooking and adding a lemon juice. I like how the fucking, like, that's amazing. Um, reduces X by 20 duration. I like that he has the flame sword and it's like, yeah, he can make chicken. I don't want to make that. Make a chicken. Here, eat up, BB. If I do say so myself. Oh, I like his voice. Oh, that hurt my ears. <laughs> okay, everyone eat it. Hey, what's this smoke? Is it an enemy attack? Wow. Seriously, it's making my eyes and throat burn. What the hell is going on? It's probably some sort of gas. Try not to breathe it in as much as you can manage. Ooh, I like her voice actress. Those cowards. Oh, wow. It, this just shield lesbian. Smoke? We love. What kind of food makes your throat burn so bad just from the smoke? Sword Les- Oh my god. I believe Alfin is. They're trying to gas Alfin? <laughs> what? Those sick bastards! I won't let them get Oh no. Calm yourselves and listen. I was simply trying to say that Alfin is the one cooking. Oh? Oh no. Oh no. Maybe I should throw in some more spices just for that extra kick. Oh no, I love this so much. I think I'll turn up the heat while I'm at it. Too. Oh my god. <sighs> Never mind me. Oh, crap. The spice is burned. Well, uh, at least the meat's coming along nicely. All right. Now I just oh, no. turn it over and then. Uh, uh... This is the AOL uh, experience, yeah. isn't it? What, uh, what are you doing over there? I'm cooking. Oh, Perfect timing. I actually just finished roasting up a chicken. Call everybody over so we can eat together. I used a ton of spices, so it's got a good punch to it. Might have overcooked it a little, but it should still taste good. <laughs> I'm starting to understand why your food always tastes so damn spicy now. Has I love this. told him that it is actually possible to have too much of a good thing? If that's the taste he truly wants, far be it from me to contradict. Wow, they fucking went. They popped the fuck off with um, the skits this time. This is amazing. Wow, I need this fucking holy shit. I need another bite. Eating is one of your great passions. What? No, it's not. There's nothing to be ashamed of. Let's dispose of the trash. Bonk. Die. Yes. <laughs> so fun. <laughs> Must be easy to pick off the bad guys from far off. It is. I mean, aside from adjusting for movement, wind speed, trajectory. <laughs> See, easy. Wow. I love that they have just like so much fucking personality and they like sound like friends. I sometimes see you chuck out in the middle of fights. What? You mean my bombs? 
bombs. Wow. Some of the things people use to clear out rocks. But I could have sworn I saw something other than fire burst from some of yours. That's because these aren't ordinary bombs. They're specially made ones filled with astral energy. Hmm. Okay. And why do you shoot the bombs after you release them? It's a part of my strategy. The effects of my bombs change when I fire bullets of a different astral element at them. Look at her eyebrows. It it difficult for enemies to she absolutely to has the brow technique down. It's beautiful. One you're using powerful bombs. The next, you're using powerful healing arts. They're kind of on the opposite ends of the spectrum, aren't they? Think of it this way. If you ever get caught up in the blast of one of my bombs and you manage not to die, I'll be able to heal you using my arts. Hmm. I'll do my best to not die then. <laughs> I wonder what we'll find. This is just great. I hope this is the same. Oh shit. Oh wow. Let's go. This could be useful. God, every part of this is just like so great. <gasps> Shit. Oh. <laughs> Can someone heal me? <laughs> Can someone fucking heal me, please? There we go. Thank you. Yes. Oof. With this, I can become even stronger. Oh no. Hold on. I'm gonna check something very quickly. I'll just switch to a just chatting. Very oh, that's fucking annoying. I'm trying to download um my lovely copy of Ghost of Tsushima. Oh. I've noticed that sometimes we come across enemies who fight like you and try to dodge our attacks at the last second. I hate those guys. I can get some hits in when they move in to attack, but otherwise they slip past damn near everything else I throw at them. If what you're seeking is a way to more reliably hit them, there is a solution. Try to outclass them on reflexes? <laughs> I possess the ability to command Earth elemental beings to some extent. They emerge as the land itself and take root on my command. They will swiftly bind the enemies, at which point you can dispatch them. Hmm. Huh? Uh, what he means is that he can make plants grow to hold the enemies in place. At least I think that's probably what he's saying. I'm glad at least one of us understands him. So basically, if we find an enemy that likes to dodge, we should let Doholin handle it. I shall do what I can within my modest means to help. God, they look so cool. Hey, Shion, where does your gun come from? What do you mean, where does it come from? When you're fighting, it looks like it just appears out of nowhere. Oh, that's transferal technology. When I don't need my weapon, I submerge it in empty space. And when I do, I summon it. Make sense? Not really. 
But it sounds pretty amazing. Huh? So that way you don't have to carry around any heavy weapons or worry about enemies trying to steal them, right? And it's a pretty cool invention. You realize you're praising the technology of your enemies, right? So? Technology is technology. It's not good or bad in and of itself. I guess that's true. Wow, there's just like a ton of these. Hey, Rinwell. But I'm glad that they have um incantation before you cast an art. Yeah. Animations and really voice acting. Power or anything, but reciting them is what allows the astral energy to come together and flow through me. It takes time to complete, but they're what lets me use such strong magic. I like her voice too. Look at her little buddy. What if someone interrupts you while you're in the middle of chanting? Then I have to start over from the beginning. As soon as my concentration breaks, any astral energy I've accumulated disperses. Got it. So once you start reciting, that's our cue to make sure that no enemies can get near enough to disrupt you. Yeah, that would be appreciated. Although, I do have one fun trick up my sleeve. Once I finish chanting a full incantation, I can hold on to a single astral art without casting it right away. Hmm. So once the astral energy's in place, you can choose to set it off whenever you want? That's amazing. Yeah. I don't fully have the hang of it just yet, but I'm sure it'll come in handy sooner or later. Get her little owl, buddy! Oh. Okay. Uh... How's my health? I mean, I wanna... Tough just looking at it. I wanna fucking challenge. Yeah. It probably mess us up good. No, I want to challenge. I'm chaotic as fuck. Yes, let's fucking go. So what was the oh L2 is the dodge mechanic, which I haven't been using. Watch out! Watch out! Watch out! Go! Watch out, watch out, watch out. Good. Watch out, watch out, watch out!
No, you won't. Oh. There, my go. Shoot. Oh, fuck. I gotta be revived. Ah, uh, life bottle. Thank you. Careful, guys! Uh, can, can someone, like, heal? <laughs> oh. Okay, we probably shouldn't do any more battles, because... Town. How cute. Let's go in the little town. Whew. I don't sense any more enemies. Oh, these horses are hot. Yes, I will take your milk. Give give me the milk. Yes, uh, all the milk. Thank you. I'm absolutely ripping off this fucking town. I, I will take the beef that you have stored in a bag. Thank you this. Ooh! We, we learned to make beef stew. Thank you for that. I, I, I would like to make beef stew. Got some chicken, got some eggs. Can I swim? <gasps> oh, wow. Oh. Rock wall. We got some good equipment. How does that work? Harder than your typical. Is it part of someone's equipment? Oh. Oh wow! Look at her fucking cool ass. Appearances to my tastes, personally. There's swimming mechanics. The water's beautiful. Wow. This is, like, 
This this literally is got some salmon. This place is rather gloomy. Why don't you lighten the mood for us while we're here then? <laughs> I'll see what I can do. Like, like that he just has a fucking curtain rod as a fucking weapon. <laughs> It's a curtain rod. You can't tell me it's not a curtain rod, please. <laughs> Sir, please. Oh, can, can you not do that in my ear? A lot. A lot. Sir, please. Stop, stop doing that noise in my ear, please. Look at the cow. Look at the little baby cow. I think there was something over here, right? I get it. No, sir, please. Ooh. Should think about eating soon. Really? Not all that hungry myself. We're making some fucking soup. Say it again. Oh. Yeah, good idea. He's like, I'm fucking hungry. You motherfucking feed me. Hopefully there's a camp like a camp thing I can go to. Oh. Oh, look at the bunny pigs? The fuck? I don't remember bunny pigs. Uh, I'm a little scared that I, uh, we're gonna get over here and we're gonna have to do something. Hello, sir. Hmm? Pardon me, if I'm not mistaken, are you two travelers? And you are? Ah, uh, where are my manners? My name is Drashen. I work for the city. Okay. We were told to come to Vincent. I'm guessing this is it? Yes. Yes, you've certainly come to the right place. I wish I could say welcome to you both. However, the gates of the city are currently sealed. Nobody is currently allowed to enter. A dangerous Zeagle is on the loose, you see. Zeigel? I don't know how to say the name. Zeigel. There's nothing to get in a twist about. We saw plenty of them on our way over. Maybe. There's no ordinary Zeigel, I fear. It's a rather large specimen, one that's free of its former constraints. Mm. Worse still, there are trouble reports of an even larger Zeagle on the loose, but that's neither here nor there. Until they both been successfully hunted down for everyone's safety the city will unfortunately remainder remain under lockdown does that go for you too despite being a resident deadly yes due to a blunder on my part i've been locked out as well i'm about to take shelter at a nearby ranch you are both more than welcome to join me if you wish <sighs> so you're planning on holding up at this ranch sorry but we've got other plans we can't just hey, hey Shion, why don't we get rid of this eagle ourselves I was afraid you were going to have another outrageous suggestion. Hear me out. The sooner we can he we take care of them, the sooner we can visit Vicent. Better than just sitting around at a ranch, right? <sighs> All right, let's do it. Spit it out. Where are these ziggles running around? They're in the tidal plains. Sh wait, surely you don't intend to go there yourselves, do you? That's exactly what we're going to do. Once we get rid of them, I want decent accommodation for the both of us. Got it? I love her. She's like, I could do it, but you better get me a goddamn suite. Like, I'm expensive. Fucking pay me. Okay, off we go. So it was that way. Oh, there's some more milk. Thank you. You know, just casually stealing the milk of our milk of the village. Casually. As a treat to myself, I would like all the milk. I'm being compensated. Pay me. God, can you imagine how bad it would if, like, you actually had to do mercenary work? That was, like, an actual job thing. Be like being an artist, like, gonna do it, but you guys are probably well, gonna fucking not pay me, are you? Really? I'm not all that hungry myself. Don't make me say it again. Uh, yeah, good idea. So it was this way. I really need to find that campground again, though. Some peppers. It's so beautiful, Mist. Welcome in. It is so fucking pretty. It's fine. I will pause it for a second. Um, I have to... Where the fuck was the... Where did he say to go? Oh, okay. And it's right near the... Okay, perfect. 
nope, 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 nope. Yeah, it really, it's fucking beautiful. And every art, um, every uh, skit seems to be like animated. I've cooked, cleaned, and sewn. Oh, wait I've until you see um, fucking hammer, uh, fucking club lesbian. I love her. She's amazing. Okay. Ooh, we can make new foods. Okay. Ooh. Ooh, that beef stew looks amazing. Is that Claude from Fire Emblem? I mean, yeah, it's pretty. But that, that's. <gasps> Oh, we're gonna make some vegetable soup, baby. Uh, we're gonna make our lovely club lesbian make this. <gasps> Looks perfect. I love her. Just as good. Wife. Wife. The I missed. You're gonna buy this. Like when you see me get into a battle, you're gonna fucking flip the fuck out. Oh, I need to go get this treasure chest because I think there's a weapon here. So we're going to do a quick battle. You ready? <laughs> Bitch, you better... I, you... you ha I got you a game! I fucking swear. <gasps> Ooh. Punch! Oh, that's... Magic girl, sorry. Bonk. Yes! The bad, like, the, the fucking battle system is chaotic as fuck. Bonk. God, it's so fun. I mean, the, the good thing about the Tales series is you can start anywhere. Dude, they went, they, they, I mean, but also they are not, um, they know that they don't always push the graphics. So this time they, I think they really wanted to go this far. It's so it's, and I'm so happy that these are all voiced. So a lot of the skits that they have sometimes aren't voiced. So it doesn't hit the same way. It's just the way you talk is sometimes. But there's like conversations your characters have um, together. If you're like in a certain town or you just had a certain food. You stupid jerk or something like that to pump yourself up. What? No. That's not what's happening like, during my these skits are so HD I'm that I'm so just taken aback. I'm to Look at her little owl. Uh, Look at her it? little owl buddy. Basically, the elemental astral energy behind each art, I guess. Astral energy? It's like a eye patch. Are you saying you can talk to astral energy? Uh, not exactly. But if I put emotion into what I say... I mean, oh, what was I saying? Really these are all self-contained. These are uh, anthologies, of. right? So you don't have okay, to start so anywhere. To um, energy, like, Basaria and Sisteria are weather, connected. Um, there's only Wait, one other you know, game that's technically a sequel. But other than that, you can start anywhere. It's like Final Fantasy. Bad guys lurking and... May lightning condemn those who bear false... Ah, what are you doing? You almost fried me with that! I just asked the astral energy to send down lightning where there were annoying boys. This is great. Mhm. Mm I don't really care for Symphonia. Um, my favorite is was Abyss. Abyss was really fun. It it was just a very small game on the PS2, and then um, Grace's F was fucking amazing. That's another one. There's very I'm very controversial with the ones that I like because I think that they're a lot of fun or the battle system's fun like i don't think symphonia actually has a great battle system i think it's kind of boring <gasps> what did i learn bonk
Wow, these things are fucking tough. So good. A hard won victory. What's this one? Ooh, someone got a new book. I love this must I love it means destiny. When RPGs change weapons when you equip something new. Armor is very rare, but I absolutely love that attention to detail. It's just like so good. So it's so good. Um Oh, you can hit recovery. Okay, let's just gonna have them eat. I didn't know that that was the wrong way. Oop, okay, hold on very quickly. Better get everything ready for tomorrow. There we go. That's better. Peace. Let's make this beef stew. Ow, my fucking ears. Okay, let's go. The invigorating morning. Uh, your hair is sticking up in the back. You don't do well in the mornings, do you? See what this one has to say. Has that skill of yours got a name? And what skill would this be, pray tell? You know, when you're talking to people around town. The way they suddenly become putty in your hands. I'm afraid I don't quite follow. I do. It's called friendly intimidation. Look at her. She's a moment. Booming voice and presto. You'll have people wrapped around your finger in no time. I would never stoop Reverse. to scandalous tricks. Oh. Any feelings of intimidation <laughs> are solely in the eye of the beholder. So there is a knack to it. Oh, poor, poor reverse. Do it? it was yeah, really fun, things. though. It was, it was fun. Training to master? Hmm, let's see. An obsession with being elegant is a must. Oh, and it helps to be old-fashioned, too. Bonus points if you speak in a way no one can understand. <laughs> if you've a bone to pick with me, it'd be quicker to just come out and say it. What? They I feel like that's that a, the redhead is a very missed character. The way that this actually feels like D and D. I can barely understand a word they're saying. And what's with the weird poses? Was it something they ate? I hope you're willing to take the blame for this one. I wasn't expecting them to take me so. I think that's another reason why, um, the way that I play and the way that it's just like I always kind of want to do dialogue. I don't necessarily want to do descripting or anything because just like kind of don't want to fill that in what is this one what do you all say to taking the path less trodden for once like if i i don't path. i don't know i don't see any path do you mean that thing that i know that that's a big way? thing for a lot of people How that play D and strong. like ttrpgs is they I'm just want to describe shit i'm like no i want to have a conversation my gut says to a bridge <laughs> poodle says your gut's wrong it's so cute really well it is definitely in the right general direction. Not that main roads are necessarily danger free, but he does have an uncanny knack for insisting on some strange and unique routes. Elvin always did like a challenge. Can't say I appreciate some of the more daredevil ways he's taken us, though. Like the landslide he insisted was a shortcut before disappearing off the edge? Nearly gave me a heart attack. I'll say, yet the intrepid explorer looked as happy as a pig in muck. Probably best we stick to doing our own orienteering. Because maybe. scenery porn. Hey, so what about this route then? Maybe if we pretend we can't hear him. Because scenery Don't porn always sounds better in the GM's head than it does to actually describe it. I get what you're saying. Maybe best to reel it back. 
Good point. I say we stick to I, the track like, like regular travelers. Here's the thing, Mist, and you know uh, not to basically give me that much shit because I will ignore it. We'll break down this wall. I, I think that you guys that have played with me or done like GMing or DMing know that like I'm I'm gonna fucking ignore that. And I'm just gonna be like, let's talk, let's battle. You know, I don't yep. want to do best. that. <laughs> I don't really want to sit there and like have a whole ass conversation. Like, mm hmm. Ex no, yeah, yeah, pretty much. Something feels odd. Oh, I see what you're saying. But like, here's the thing. Um, and, you know, I always say that Zack's really good, but Zack's really good at conveying something within a time, like, not a con time constraint, but getting a point across in a very decent way and, uh, descript you know, describing something and me being absolutely fucking interested. You know what I mean? And, like... I fucked up. The typing of those are to maximize the imagination and details from players. Yeah, 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 yeah. But you know what I mean? I, I think that I really enjoy uh, the way that Werewolf just kind of doesn't fucking, you know, worry about that and lets me just fucking go for it. And you do a different way in which I don't have to worry about the information. That it can't be described, which doesn't help. Yeah, but the the way that they're playing is they're they're making the DM essentially describe all the shit and be like, oh, that thing's cool. I would rather be like, oh, you know, I would rather have a conversation and describe it than have the DM just continuously describe it because then I don't feel engaged. Imagine your worst fear. Oh, oh, are you are you gonna fucking? Oh, sounds like Inuyasha. But see, even when you did you did Call of Cthulhu, you you were relying on the players to listen to your thing and then also, you know. But you know, we've had that conversation of like, I don't want to play a game where the GM is talking the entire time because I'm going to get fucking bored. And I know that that's just really unusual and it's a normal thing. And, um, another person. Yeah, I don't necessarily, I don't want to talk about that. And but, but that was so surprising when you're like, oh, no, that's normal. I'm like, what? <laughs> why, why would I, why would I want to play when I'm not doing anything? You know, and that's, I, I'm not bashing anyone that, 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 that the way that they want to play. But if I don't feel engaged, I'm going to be fucking bored. Oh, so that's the point you were trying to make. You know what? I think you're right. When I listen to the podcast, it's just him talking. Right or no? Wait, let me let me pause this for a second. Especially because Matt... Oh. So when he invented Critical Role, a lot of people thought that they could copy that and get away with it. And it's like, no, he's like, yeah, yeah. And he has a career where that's his fucking job, you know? But, you know, I, I think you're right. When I watched, when I, no, I'm sorry, when I listened to it, 
they really didn't do much. And I was like, I can't, I don't want to do this. No one is talking, no one's, you know, no, nothing's happening in here. Plus a bring. Is there no end to them? We're making some progress. Keep up the pressure. That'll bring you down. Do you play a game? What are you gonna play? Oh, oh, okay. Let's let's move away from him, guys. Oh, he's fine. Oh, okay, okay. Shit. Well, do you want to play something? Whoop. This fucking mantis is like kicking our asses. You could always just stream Final Fantasy. That is an option missed. No, you can't. Oh! Um, I'm gonna go ahead and apple gel myself. Weren't you gonna like... Well, high action, I wouldn't, I would not, I would not call that, um... Can you heal me, sis? Fucking... Okay. There we go. Um... Maybe you should do, uh, Resident Evil. Oh, yeah. Fucking shit. Hold on. Which album? Which album cover? Is there bugs? Fucker. <laughs> Keep dying. Oh, we. Okay, we gotta do some shit. Wake the fuck up. Oop. Where's my like? Okay. Oh. Go heal you. Don't know how you died. We did it! Um, we could play a game together, miss, if you wanted to stream something. Shooting guns. I mean, I don't mind Dead by Daylight. Uh, Final Fantasy IV. I don't know about Final Fantasy XIV, though. Greetings again, travelers. I gather you've decided to take refuge at the ranch after all. Actually, we took care of the Ziegel problem for you all. What? Surely you dressed. It's sheer ferocity gives even the city's own guardsmen pause. You play DVD? Okay, um, 
I will go eat in like a minute and then we can play DVD. Sure. You can just get your shit set up. Okay, yeah. I'm not gonna read this. What? what? <laughs> sure. Great. Is this autosave? Oh. What are you fighting for? <gasps> Ooh, we got the we got the cutscene. What's this cutscene? I'm Renan, you're Danon. There's oh. no way. What could <gasps> Danon like you possibly gain from helping a Renan like me? Oh. <gasps> you really can't feel pain? It's just another thing I don't have. Whoa. I don't remember anything about my past. A man numb to pain. And a woman whose very touch deals nothing but. Whoa. You think this curse? Is some kind of great ability? Balls in your court, soldier. What do you say? I want to fight. Whoa. Taste freedom. This, this looks a chance working together. so fun. It's only over when you give up. You can trust me, you know? Maybe even lean on me. Until the day I died, I knew I would be alone. I wish we had never met. <gasps> oh, wow. Then I wouldn't have to feel this way. Oh. God damn it. I have Whoa. everyone to thank for that. Including especially you, Alvin. I think this is gonna definitely be one of the